Rocket, how to download the official OpenAI Chat GPT app, down pointing finger. You want to show off that cool new technology to your friends? Here is a step by step tutorial how to access Chat GPT on your phone. 1. Open App Store on your iPhone or Play Store on your Android device. 2. Search for Chat GPT. 3. From the list of results, you don't install any of this SHT scam products because there is no official OpenAI Chat GPT app, and if you fall for these, then you deserve to get ripped off. 4. Close App Store whatever. 5. Open Chat GPT in browser share add to home screen bonus tip when you log in first and create the shortcut from there you don't have to re-log in again. Also, whoever uses emojis in tutorials or edit posts is cringe, why would you do that it doesn't add anything useful. Considering how many people must be looking for one, it's kind of baffling to me that OpenAI don't just create an official app. I know app development isn't cheap, but even a very basic wrapper around the web app would probably do the job. Thanks I downloaded it. I don't know why but now my phone is slow and my credit card company is calling me. Smiley face. There are a few valid useful GPT apps that are free including Poe. Simple and effective tutorial. 10 out of 10. The app stores need to kick all these scammer apps off, that shit pisses me off. Sometimes emojis help with delivering tone, woman shrugging. Sometimes emojis help with delivering tone, unamused face. Sometimes emojis help with delivering tone, hugging face. Same data, different tones. Which means more data. Data is beautiful. I love data so much, nerd face. Gif gif e y 2 i 2 oak w g z h 5 i o r p 4 k downsized. It's odd to me they just didn't make it a proper PWA. Gif gif e g 5 by 63 gur l j j v k. I haven't been able to sign up for it for about 2 3 weeks now. Is it temporarily not allowing sign-ups? Man shrugging. Wow I did not know about add to home screen thank you so much. Ha noise. The fact that this has so many upvotes tells me one thing very few people have any idea what they are doing. GPT is really showcasing the madness of crowds. Did not know you could add to home screen thanks, bouquet, 100. I did this without being told. I'm a clever robot. Thanks bro. I downloaded one of the apps from the and I've never been so happy. Now the Nigerian prince keeps asking for money, but he smiles more. Can someone please help me figure out how to get an account active again? I got blocked for trying to log in from multiple devices too much. I already downvoted you, but then I read further. Why not just the iOS link? I can't find the app. Chat GPT shouldn't have been released to the public. Do everyone a favor and get on with your lives instead of messing with something you don't understand. I don't think Chat GPT wrote these instructions, they actually make sense. I am not a robot. Chat GTP wouldn't let me use my Google Voice number to set up my account. I don't want to give it my phone number. Any workarounds? Finally someone said it. No open AI does not have an app. Rolling eyes face, celebratory hands in the air, celebratory hands in the air, celebratory hands in the air, celebratory hands in the air. I'm glad you said that I had three apps downloaded but I didn't pay BC I thought in my head why pay for these every month or year when chat GPT is free. Thanks for the laugh. However, there are countries where chat GPT is not available yet for unknown reasons. Even Bing chat isn't available. So shitty apps like those are the only alternatives to get a feel of chat GPT. Emojis is what gives away someone using GPT when it comes to big outlines. I just call them out without telling them how I know even after getting downvoted and flames. 
On my PC I can't log into my account through my browser with any success infinite verification loop. I downloaded an interface on GitHub for PC and have never had an issue using it since. Emojis are friendly. Reddit less so. Nice. This was already here but K. I was thinking of making one myself given you only need an API key to gain access and from what I saw they are free it shouldn't be too hard to make a simple app that only needs a user's API key to work. You can get a real chat GPT app by downloading Po. You can also use different AI on Po. Are emojis cancelled now? There is app in App Store named Prompter you can use it free with your own open AI API key all the models supported as well as system messages. Ha 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 nice post except for the emojis part. They give life to a text, playful face. Good instructions but every time I use the shortcut on iOS it requires me to log in. Any ideas? Military medal. Whatever I use. It only has like 1000 downloads. There is no point unless it has additional features which won't happen. You can easily use it in the browser. Voice GPT is the best one so far. Not enough emojis, how am I supposed to understand your post? Jokes aside, good call out on the stuff that's flooded the app stores. They could at least make it a PWA so it doesn't keep making new tabs in Chrome and it feels like an actual app. Will it work for Italy bypassing the ban? Haha <laughs> I liked it. They needed Chatkp to code the perfect app that can hack into everyone phones and that took a bit longer than expected with GPT-4S. But if my friends see it on my phone, then they'll know I cheated on the group assignment. For real. Still waiting for them to just make it a PWA. Seems like it wouldn't take very long to add, but I'm sure they have had their hands busy lately. In fact get chat GPT to create the app, woman shrugging. Make an official chat tap then bitch. Have used shortcut on my iPhone to put chat sing my own user login. LOL had a guy at work install a bunch of these I was like no you clown bookmark the link I sent you. I guess I went to the wrong site. Wanted me to create an account and charge me $7, pensive face. When will image input be available in browser? Maradi. I feel like I'm being scammed and I haven't started reading yet. I use the Nova GPT app on my phone it claims to be GPT-4. That's what I do. I prefer to use Chrome on my iPhone so I set up a shortcut that displays it as an app that opens GPT-4 in Chrome. This post is dumb and I only needed two steps to find it. Make the post smaller dumbass, winking face. Lamo 2 true. PWA please. I just recently found one and using it GPT for iOS, and downloaded Mugpt on MVP, cause I need fast cut and paste. The inline option is kind of hit and miss, I am expecting less formatting if I can use inline directly in some of my docs. Eyes Edge browser for chat Kpt, it seems to work better there. The only problem is that every time you close it, it wipes your chat history. It looks like an ad for chat AI. Is that the right site? I just show them chat in WhatsApp. No need to download. Safe. 62815-1708-4333. If you didn't know it yet upvote me okay?